Ladies and gentlemen, today we look at Ronald Koeman High Medium Work Rates 3 Star 3 Star Combination. High Medium, he likes getting forward. So he's high attacking, medium defensive. Now, powered him up with the shadow. 100% now. That's the one I was going to go for. I used him in DM actually with Kante. Now, the reason why with Kante is because I like one DM who likes going forward and one DM who likes tracking back. In the first match, I drove the ball forward with him and look what he did here. He gets right into the box showing that he's got good attack positioning and from there, he scored from there. I was like, huh? I'm not lying to you guys. I just shot because I just wanted to test his shot out. Like, I thought he was going to sky it or something and he went zooming past the goalkeeper into the back of the net. i got to say, this guy has a DM. Very nice. Kante. He's brilliant with him because Kante does a lot of the defending. Don't get me wrong, he's really good at defending too. He's so good at defending. But when he's going forward, I just want him to go forward. I mean, look at him. He's fantastic. He's strong, aggressive, really good at intercepting. Very, very good. Now, can't lie, when I was going forward, I realized quickly, man, the guy's not got the agility and balance to play forward. Like, you can't play this guy in camp. You can't play him in strike. I remember watching Danny Aarons before Primark on Moments coming out and he was saying, you know what, this is my striker. He's not your striker. You know, you don't need to give people false hope. I mean, you could never use this guy in strike. You know, he's not going to be very successful there. Three star, three star in this stage of FIFA? We're getting, what, what day is it today? 20th March. No chance. But this guy is a fantastic DM. I think I can't fault him in that position. Okay, I'm not going to lie, he felt a bit clunky at times. His agility and balance is not very good at all. But he's got good pace. He's got a very good shot. He's got good attack positioning. He's got fantastic passing. He's passing both short and long. Absolutely sensational. His defending is very, very good. Very good at intercepting. Very, very strong. Aggressive. I like everything about this card. He's very physical. He's got great stamina. So he can play DM. He can bump up, down, up, down. He can get up. Up, uh, up up, and down the pitch, very nice. You can see, yeah, he makes some really nice tearing runs across the pitch. But I have to give this card a lot of respect because he's a lot of fun to use. I mean, you don't know. When he takes a shot, you don't know where that's going, man. That might be going at the back of the net. So I've got to say, he's very, very exciting to play with. But don't get any funky ideas and try using this guy in strike or cam, I wouldn't. Honestly, I wouldn't. I think this guy is best suited to a central mid maximum or a DM position role. But you can see when he gets forward, he, the man the man means business. Look at this. Very good, aggressive tackle right there. So I've got to give it in the DM position. He's very effective. And you can see from the clips, he does a very good job there. He does a lot of dog work, gets the ball back, drives the ball forward. He's got fantastic passing. And of course, Passing in the game at the moment just feels so bad. It's nice and refreshing to have somebody who can pass the ball both long and short very effectively. His free kicks are brilliant. Okay, I didn't take the best free kick here, but I've used, I think I had three free kicks with him, and trust me, they're all very, very good. His crossing as well is fantastic. So I've got, I'm going to give this card a lot of respect. I'm going to give him a 9 out of 10. I think he's so much fun to use. He reminds me a lot of David Beckham's card. I think David Beckham's card's better. Maybe not in defending, but definitely going forward, David Beckham's got a better card. Because he's 3-star, 4-star, isn't he? And his finesse shots are cracked. This guy's got a very good shot as well, though. And I think I picked him up for 790k. That's, that's really good value. Because this guy can play centre-back, CDM, central mid. Very versatile card. I mean, look at this. Him against uh, Team of the Year Lewandowski. And he gets the ball off him quite easily. Very good card. Agility and balance and skill is a weakness though.